In this video, I'm going to show you how to tie the slip knot. The slip knot is a very handy knot to create a sliding loop on the end of a rope. And it is easy to tie this loop in correctly, and I will show you that point as well. So what you do is you create a loop with the standing part here, and then with the, or the running end here, sorry, the running end here. And with this loop, you take this section, the standing part, you create another bite, and you pass it through this loop, and you begin tightening the knot until you create a slip knot. The reason that you put the standing part instead of the running end here is this slip will slide all the way to the end and it will stop. If in the other instance you choose to put this knot here and you use the running end, what will happen is if you tighten this knot and you decide, hey, I need to loosen it up and you pull tension on this, the knot will fall apart. This is a critical, critical safety point. Instead, you want to use the standing part of the, the rope. So you've got this loop here. Use the standing part, not the running end, to create the loop, to pass through. And now, no matter what you do to pull on it, it will not come apart and have something very bad happen. That is a critical point, even though you can choose either direction to tie the slip knot, do not make it a habit of using the running end to create the loop because of the danger of it being so easy under tension for it to pop right out. The slip knot is a super useful knot to know because it allows you to create a sliding loop at the end of a rope that is fully adjustable and only takes a second or two literally to tie. But the critical part is make sure that the bite comes through on the standing part, not the running end, because if you use the running end to create the loop and you put tension on this, that loop can pop and you can be in real trouble for whatever you're using it from. I go over those points and more about the slip knot page 80, 81 in my book, The Most Crucial Knots to Know, to make sure you stay safe and you know how to tie your knots properly so you can use them to tie loads in your vehicle, tie knots in your house, or you know whatever you need to tie with a slip knot. My name's Aaron Linsdow. I'm a polar explorer and professional adventurer. Please check out links below in the description to my books, Antarctic Tears, Lost at Windy Corner, Adventure Expedition One, how to keep your feet warm in the cold, the Jackson Hole Hiking Guide, the most crucial knots to know, and the 2024 Total Eclipse Guides, as well as my shows, Antarctic Tears and Lost at Windy Corner. Please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel so you can get more adventure information like this and to learn about your slip knots.